family, friends, veterans, and gamers, educators, and students. Welcome to Grumpy Gnome Gaming. I am Grumpy Gnome. Let's get some grump on with some banished baby. And we are continuing our little uh, Danish town of Solvang. So here we go. Do, 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 do. Resume. Oh my gosh. Um, let, let's get them running first and then we'll do some do some talking here. What do we got? That's the event log. The town arrival. We can minimize you for now. Okay, we have I don't know if you guys if you guys check my comments or not, but we um oh my gosh, and I hit play. Oh my god, they look like freaking ants in a hot pan right now. That's why. Boom. Five speed. No pause. So I am still going to honor the no pause thing going on. And I'm going to try to address. I don't think we need any of those. So dismiss. And I'm going to close you down. Cha Ching. Oh, my God. We got another one. What do you got? You are bringing us roof tiles. Ha. We're not going to need that for a long time. Anyway, a lot of suggestions have come in, and um, Ese de Hombre, <laughs> who's about as far away from Spanish as you can get, um, th thank you so much for all of your you know tips and advice and criticism. I, I appreciate it, and you know what? I'm really going to try to spend more time listening to you guys. So we've got the first dense tree shack is here. And I believe we turned this into a stone shack. Yes, we did. Now, it's more than one of you have given me permission to already cross the river. And what we're going to do is we're going to go in search of more um, resources. And I'm trying to think. Do we want to cross here? No, there's not really a lot of build space over here. Because the one thing that most of you have been screaming for is another dense tree shack. Now, we can probably drop one right here. And I don't know. Maybe this road here would take us across. I don't know. Or we go over the beaver dams to here. And I think this is what most of you were suggesting is to cross that side. What are you bringing us? Do, 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 do. Hardened steel. To, what's our tool situation? We need tools. You know what, man? We might just do something with you. Oh, my gosh. And I should already get the crafting going so that we have stuff to trade. And I can't hit pause, so what I'm going to do is park you over to the side. I'm going to open up my inventory real fast here to see what we got tobacco leaf that we can trade. I've never traded tobacco leaf before. So the first thing I'm going to do is dump in a hundred just to see what that gets us. And uh, do I need to hit enter? No, I don't. And it only trades for one. Okay, 14 times 25. 10 times 25 is 250. And another half of uh, 250 is another 125 for 375 ish. So we almost need, you know what? Maybe I'll throw a. Oh, there we go. And also, somebody, I think it was Ombre, that told me I am making a crap ton of sausages and no steak so let's check on that because that's boom sausages boom sausages you are correct so let's go ahead and kick um, this dude over to steak or right there if I if I wasn't such an old man I would put them both on I love a challenge, both on steak to kind of balance this out. Now, it looks like we can also use another butcher here, but you know what? We're going to have to get back to that 
The first thing I want to do here is up that tobacco leaf inventory to a thousand because that's going to give us a little bit more buying power. And I'm just going to keep you parked, right, I think, right over the chat box <laughs> just because I'm running out of real estate here. Anyway, uh, let's move you over to here so we can always open you up when we need you. Uh, the tools are still a crisis. So what are we missing? We're not getting any iron. That kind of sucks, doesn't it? I'm thinking maybe bring a couple more carts in. What are you bringing? Um, you're there. Are you? Is there somebody here? Oh my God, there is. What are you bringing? Nectar, maple, feathers. No. And royal armor. No, that's the last thing we need. No, I dismiss you. Go away. And oh my gosh, I don't know what you are. So when we when we close the window, it just leaves a blank trader window. You think it should close all the way? Okay, where are? I know we've got a smitty up here. Do we have a second smitty anywhere? I, and I think we've got a cart that makes food. Those are the bee shelters. So we're not hurting for food at all. But you know what? I think, why don't we do this temporarily? And this totally goes against my grain. Oh my God, we don't even have stone to make stone tools. Wow. Wow. We suck. Okay. Let's get some more tree action going. I think what we're going to do is we're going to cross the river and maybe have this come into the center. So let's uh, grab some more roadage. Also, Essa, you mentioned something about um, stoning roads. I don't think I'm going to be stoning roads for a while, only because we need to... Um, You know what? I lied. I think, you know what? That'll outline the top. So yes, we're going to put that road in. I'm actually going to build off of this one down here because we got this bend right here. And I think if we were to go here, we would lose some of it to the water. And this is actually an area where we can build some housing. So why don't we do that? Let's come down here, come over here, and we're going to put a beaver dam right across there so here we go where's my beaver dam if you were a beaver dam where would you be perhaps somewhere under a tree like me okay here we go and right there is that it yeah come across come across come across now gonna make you look pretty boom boom right there that almost looks good boom that looks better boom right there Ching, put you in. Make sure we got the road lined up. Because that would suck if we didn't. Do, 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 do. I think that's it. Boom, right to there. And then we're going to cross over and we're going to find out where we're going to put this new tree shack thing. I think that's good enough. Boom, right there. Okay. And a second dense tree shack. That seems to be what the populace is asking for. So, and I'm going to open this up to, I think I'm going to open it up in the same direction that we have that one going. So let's do the flippy thing. Flip. Nope. Oh, no, we need that one up there. I think that's it right there, isn't it? Nope, tower is on our side. Tower is on our side. Okay, go across. And tower on our side, flip. I think that's it. By golly, Miss Molly. So let's come on down here like that. And let's go ahead and get this thing. Oh, well, can we place it off of this one? We actually could. But you know what? I'm thinking maybe use this for a little residential and uh, industrial area. So why don't we come down 
to this down here. And oh my gosh, I got to come over further. Right there. You know what? I'm going to guess it looks like it's going to jump up one. And I'm going to guess that it is going to jump over one to the right. So I'm going to bring this back one. So cha-ching right there. And it did not. It did jump up, but it did not jump over. Okay. We can deal with that. So let's go back to our shacky thing. And I do see that another... I do see that there was another trader that came in, but we're not going to deal with him right now. Right there. I think that's it. So cha-ching, put you in, and yes, that looks good. That's good enough for the government. I'm not going to worry about that. And we're going to watch them build that. And then just like over on the other side, we're going to grab a shack. Whoops, a shack right away. And we're going to put that shack right here. Do, do, cha-ching. And let them build that. And I'm probably going to grab a stockpile already. And we're going to go from the, should we do log only? You know what? Log only might not be a good idea, but I really don't want it to fill up with garbage. Right to there. And I think for the time being, let's grab a generic stockpile and maybe put it right in between the two. Right there. And we'll put a priority on that so they get that thing cleared out. Because I don't want them taking all of those resources back to wherever they're going. Oh, man. I sure hope my chat window is working. I can't see it. Marlene, Saskia, if you're there, I'm sorry. I do not see you in chat. Also, it would really be great to have uh, Tim join us again. Uh, it's me, Tim. And also, it would be great if uh, Essay would uh, would join us. Okay, that is built. That is built. First thing we're going to do is upgrade the Tiny Shack. And I think I'm going to go ahead and already throw at least... What's our labor? Oh my god, we have laborers. Two. Two people. Oh, no. One. One into there so that they can already start planting this area now I'm pretty content that this stone once it gets going is going to give us everything that we need so I'm not going to sweat that we're still going to have to go a little bit of toolless thing going on oh we're going to buy these tools up here weren't we so what do we got count why do we have zero to back up oh, because i never put a trader in oh nuts oh man old man mistake there doggone it doggone it okay let's see what else we can do here why oh that, that's a river we may as well throw another person onto the beaver dam here and maybe start a little housing community up here. So I'm trying to think, how are we going to do this? I'm definitely going to get another Smitty and maybe another Taylor up here. So should we build some stuff along the road and put some housing behind it? And also, I think SA has been asking for a market. And as much as I want to say that we're pretty content without a market, you know, we may entertain putting one in. And we should probably frame this. So why don't we 
bring that up like that. And I'm just going to go ahead and put the framework in for this. I'm going to flip. Don't freak out on me. Don't fall out of your seats. There we go. And what we're going to do here is I'm actually going to frame the stone shack so that I know where my building, where my building uh, boundaries are. Gonna pull that back a little because I know we're gonna put another beaver dam there. And we may as well, if I can see it, start from this road here and just go across just to make it nice and square. And you know, it's been a practice of mine to always in these corners put stockpiles in. And I think we may just do that. So let me go ahead and just grab some regular stockpiles. Because God knows you can never have enough of those. Um, where are they? They are here. They are here. They are here. You know, let's start in the corner right, right here and maybe do a 4x4. Four four. So cha-ching. 4x4 four four there and here. Cha-ching. 4x4. Four four. Come down here. 4x4. Four four. Cha-ching. And down here. Well, we're not going to get a 4x4 four four in. But maybe leave that one open for now. Anyway, see that's gonna that's just gonna give us some more stockpiles spread out about the place. We probably could have done the same over here with the tree shack, but you know what? It's all good. It's good in the hood. Can't do anything over here or down here, but we could have done these up here. And you know what? I'm we're. I can't, I know I'm not going to be able to see. Oh my God, why is that ring of influence so high? I think it was because we wanted to get this bend in. We weren't taking into consideration lining these up. So it's it's good. We can live with that. I just got to figure out where I'm going to cross my, my, my river over here. And uh, let's flip again. So here we go. Flip, 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 flip. And maybe, because I don't want to lose any more real estate inside there. There's, I think we're going to go. Oh, man, that something is blocking us right there. So we can't, we can't road there. I mean, we could road right here and then jump across. And I think that might be what we do. Or we have to go all the way to this point and cross, which also wouldn't be bad. Maybe we'll do that. We'll cross right here because that's kind of on our main street here, too. So let's do that. Let's um, let's put the bridge in first. So cha-ching, cha-ching. I don't remember what bridge we were using. I think we were just using a generic wooden bridge. Was it this one? Small wooden. I don't rem I think we were just using the generic wooden bridge. And just draw the line across. So right there. And I'm going to let them put that in already. Because we may want to run over to that side and do something. Okay. Let's see what else we got. Food. Let's always keep an eye on food. And it looks like we want to still get look into that tool issue. Firewood, I should probably put a limit on our firewood again. And here we got another person in the trading dock area. Almond seeds, no. Don't want no almond seeds. We got the thousand tobacco leaf. Let's go ahead and buy those tools. So here we go. Um, yeah, we want all 25 of them. 25, boom, enter. Oh, I got to put my uh, this count in here. And let's just uh, go. Oh, my, I can't do it that way. So what do we need? 350? Okay, 350, enter. Boom, there it is. Trade it. Dismiss you. Thank you very much for coming by. And now we got some tools in our inventory. And I already see the first thing we need to do over here is put in... 
another storage facility, another one of these. So let's come here. Let's, I don't know where we saw that at. It's right there, baby. Okay, and we want the, the bright green. Boom. I don't know why. Oh my gosh, we're throwing stuff on the ground. You guys thought I was going to say something bad. Nope, just stuff. <laughs> okay, that's... You know what? I'm going to put you right there like that. So cha-ching. So now we've got storage for that. And since we've got that little space on this side... I'm just going to road it over there. I was going to put a little stockpile in there, but you know what? Let's just bring this across. Look at that. It was almost like it was made to go in and put you across there so we know how much room we have to deal with. Okay. That's done. Check. Oh my gosh, they have our bridge finished. What can we do? Oh my gosh. It almost looks like farmland over here you know what i'm thinking maybe start the mission over here we got a lot of rugged shorelines to deal with um maybe the first thing we should do is square off some area over here so i'm thinking let's Let's get a little bit of road, come off of here. We'll go to the this far. How far can we go? Right to there. Okay, and then how far can we go this far? Right to there. Awesome. So we basically got one thing right here. Okay. Um, don't know what we're going to put there yet, but we'll put something in. Did we ever get a bundling shed put in? Here's the bundling shed. Yeah. Okay. Oh my gosh, we're, we're crooked. There we are. Straighten it out a little bit. Okay, let's see. We brought the tools, but the tools didn't seem to do anything for anybody. You know what? I'm almost thinking we need to start making some iron. Or do we have iron ore? I know this smitty here will not make rough tools. And we hardly have the wood and the stone to make tools, but we're getting iron from someplace. I don't know where. But maybe we should do that. We should get us an iron source. How about an iron shack? Really? Let's do that. Let's get us an iron shack somewhere. And where could we put that? We can actually put that right underneath the stone shack here. Or we go across the river. Doggone it. I need you guys in chat to tell me what to do. <laughs> okay, let's go ahead and drop another beaver dam right here. And... Do, 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 do. Here. Here? No, here. Here. Okay, let's flip you and drop another beaver dam is that it? Is that it? That's it. Right there. So cha-ching. And then we'll drop another road going out to the beaver dam. Right to there. Cha-ching. And do we want to do an iron shack out here? You know what? We can actually do the mines over here if we don't want to do an iron shack. Oh, nuts. Are you bringing tools? You know what? I really... Almonds again? Well, you know, we do grow a lot of almonds in the Central Valley. What are you? A stable. Why are you on pause? Because you don't have lumber? nuts on a biscuit did we ever drop the other stable yes we did are we making domesticated animals but you know what food is not our main priority 
I think you guys yelled at me last time I did the, um, <laughs> last time I dropped the, um, mines against the mountains. So what are you bringing? Charcoal? No, thank you. Okay. Let's, um, and you know what? We have no nomad attracting things yet, do we? So that should bring up the question, do we want nomads? And I'm thinking right here might be something for it. Let's go ahead and frame this in like this. And that gives us these two little squares right here to work with. And we've already got one lamp post here, but that doesn't attract anything. So why don't we it's I don't know, it's kind of weird to put the homeland statue in here. It it would be really, 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 really neat if that nomad map thing, where's the nomads at? Or the natives, that's what I wanted. If these things attracted nomads, totem poles are mounted, they don't okay, no. This is a canoe. This is a monument, but it doesn't attract nomads. And this is, okay, that's the ceremonial ground. This one, do you have anything that attracts nomads? No, no, no. You know what? I think their town hall does. Hunting grounds, hunter. Medicine man, fenceless burial ground, sacred tent, okay, for spiritual happiness, school, chief's hut, information. It doesn't say that it does attract nomads. So I think we're going to have to go old school. Let's go old school and um, go to the bell. I think it was this one. No, it wasn't. Was it this one? Yes. Homecoming statue, and we will put the homecoming statue right there, or do we face the town arrival? I'm thinking let's face the town arrival, 1-1, one, one, and drop you right there. So cha-ching, and then cha-ching, there we go. And now let's lamppost it with this one. And we're going to put the lamp post facing float, float the, uh, the statue. Or is that, is that better? I think that might be better. Put you right there. Yeah, right there. Cha-ching. Okay, there we go. And then we'll see if we can get some nomads coming in that way. Okay, we're probably going to need some housing. And let's let's look across the river. See, oh my god, they're really putting this thing in quick. Oh, that is awesome. Awesome blossom. I'm going to extend this road across here just in case we need to do something. And you know what? Minus well take it all the way into the mountain. No. No need to. Let's just bring it back and find out where this border comes down. And then we're just gonna we're just gonna frame that. And then we'll work off of that. So there comes down to whoops, no, come on. No, I guess we gotta use the calibrated eyeball to figure this out. Is it right there? No, nope, right there. No, nope. I can't even see my road now. Doggone it. Don't you cover me up like that. There we go. Nope. Right there. That might be it. Something tells me one more. Oh, no. One too many. But anyway, as long as we're here, let's go ahead and do this. Cha-ching. And cha-ching. And then take that one. I'm not even going to take that little piece out right there because we're probably going to continue this direction. But that's going to frame that which is good 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 what 
a log stockpile. Good, 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 good. Okay, maybe get some tool action going in up here. And um, yeah, I think we're going to need some tool action. And this is going to be totally unnecessary, but it's just something that I do because <laughs> I like to do it. Doom, is that it? Doom, 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 doom. Yep, and that. And then come down one and then go doop, doop, boom. Give him a little, little bit of driveway. Okay, we're going to need, well, one thing we're going to need is storage over here. So I'm almost thinking, why don't we bring this road up to here, take this road up to here, take this one across, and then see what we can do over here. And I'm almost thinking, remember what we did in the first build where we killed everybody? <laughs> Let's do it again. Another big fishing region right up here. That might work. So let's do that. Let's take this road and see how far across we can come with it. We can go right to Thar. And I'm actually going to pull it back one, just in case I want to do something here. Now, you know what? I, I really, I'm not a fan of these little ones. I would really like to get like one bigger, nice looking one put in. And I don't think the the Indian ones have a trader, dude. And I think the closest thing we got was the forest trader. Where are you? Are you you're the trader? What do you look like? Yeah, see this one. I think this might be the trader that we want to go with. Because it's just it's gonna it's more aesthetically pleasing to our area than the jetty one. But you know what? This trader does not go on the water. So what the heck does he trade? Or who trades with him? That's interesting. I've never used this trader before. I'm almost curious just to just to drop it in and see what he does. Now, we did that with another building also. We dropped it in just to see what it does, and I don't think it did anything for us, but I hope this isn't the building. There's the rustic look. Why don't we just stick it right here and see what it does? So, cha-ching. And let's frame it in. And you know what? I'm pro as soon as they build it, I'll put somebody in it. And then we will see what it does. Oops, just, just a single. That's just a single. Oh, no, you're going in. One more. And are you going in one more? Right there. Yep. One more. And that's all she... Oh, over. Oh, my God, you're going over. And nothing else? Nope. Anything else here? Nope. Nope. That's it. Okay. As soon as they get this thing built, we're going to go ahead and see if we can throw somebody into there and see if this thing trades anything. Doggone it, chat. You're driving me nuts. How are we doing with resources? Stone looks like it's starting to come in. And I think um, I think we're gonna hit that iron shack next. No, no more roof tile, man. That's twice for roof tiles, and twice for almond seeds. Here we go. I'm gonna put one person in you, and just to see what you do. And I'm gonna actually shut you guys down because I don't want anybody to go into those trading posts and shut you down like that 
And yeah, I know we've got one too many traders now. No, we got one of one, which is actually what I want. So where's my question mark person? You are a trader. Okay, let's come on down here to trader. One of one. Wait a second. Then who's in here? Is it just a worker? But anyway, somebody is in there. So we'll leave, we'll let that go. Inventory. Textile limit. Oh, is this the guy who trades the furs? Where did we find him? No. Yes. Trading post goods for furs. Okay. You know what? I'm. It looks nice. If nothing else, it looks nice there. And we'll call it a decorative item. Here we go. Corn seeds. It is only appropriate that we purchase corn seeds. I know we don't have to. Doggone it. Do we want to? You know what? I do want corn seeds because for the mission district, that's where we're going to put it. Um, 3,500. We can do that. So inventory tobacco. I'm going to kick you up to 3,500. Boom and delete. You know what? I am not going to kick you up to 3,500. I'm going to leave you at a thousand and I'm going to put other products in here. So let's put you in the corner for now. I don't know what you are, but let's close you. Open this up. And apples is the next thing. And by golly, we need to get a bakery running. Because daddy wants himself some apple strudel. Do, 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 do. I don't think the Kringles have apple in them. But we can do apple. I want a pork butcher. And look at that, the steaks have caught up with the sausages. So before we go any further, I'm gonna, you're at steak. I'm gonna kick you back to sausage from beef. I believe it was, yes. And let's go ahead and put in a, um, a pork butcher down here too. So pork, pork, pork. As a matter of fact, we may wanna go Two. And that's going to, okay, that's going to extend me a little bit around here. So we're going to do that. Let's go ahead and do this totally unnecessary thing. And I'm going to put in two more butchers right over here. And those were the tiny ones. Tiny butcher. And which one was it? Butcher? Tiny Butcher. Do, 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 do. Here we go. And oh my God, they do have different facets. Rustic. On the Butcher, leave a space. Cha-ching. And then one, two, three, four different facets. Rustic. Cha-ching. Let them put those in. And then we're going to have pork chops and we're, oh my gosh, are they going to give me an option for bacon also? Do, 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 lamb chops, venison, pork chops right there and sausages. Oh my gosh. Boar. I... You know what? If this was boar, I think it would say so. I'm just going to have to trust that it is pork. And it looks like they're going in. You know what? I don't know what's going on with you, but let's let's get you built for some reason. And you need lumber. I don't know if our... I don't know if our lumber person cutter 
can one two can make um, lumber. Whoops, didn't want to do that. Okay, let's go ahead and cut this thing down. Oh wait, we're apples. That's what we're gonna throw in over here. And you know what? I think apples are only a single one also. So let's go ahead and give you a thousand apples. And you got a thousand tobacco and pear. We're not doing anything with pears yet. So how about a thousand pear? I don't want to do that much though. Pork, beef steak. Oh my God, tobacco is going off the shelves here. You know what? I think you guys were right when you said put in another one of the, um, the tents. So let's do that. Let's go ahead and get... Um, I'm just going to give you 3,500 in this. Actually, you just need another. Did we ever put the apple in? Yes, we did. So let's kick this up to... I'm actually going to kick it up to 3,000. There we go. That'll be good. That, that'll be good for the time being. And I thought there was a minimize button, but I don't see it on this one. So that kind of sucks. And we need a trader in there. So there's that. And there's a trader. Okay, we'll watch that. God, I wish it had a minimize button, though. Okay, another one of the tents. And we may as well put it right over here. Because I think that's probably the best place to put it. Let's go ahead and grab fire tent. Fire, I think that's what it was called. Do, 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 do. A gatherer. Am I going the wrong direction? How about next to this thing? A tobacco patch, a fire tent. We're going to do the flippy thing. So flip, flip, flip. And stick you right in. Right there. I think that's it. Let's go ahead and put you in. So cha-ching. And you do have an insert in you. So let's go ahead and get that put in. So we got the road coming across. And then we're going to come around. And then we're going to come around. And we're going to hit that. And then coming down here, one, two, three, boom. And then one, two, three. I think that was it. Yep. Boom. Awesome. Let them build that. And then hopefully that's going to take care of our, our tobacco thing that we got going on over here. <sighs> awesome. Do, 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 do. I'm, I'm almost second guessing myself right now to see if I even hit record. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I did. And um, I'm not going to I'm not going to stop to find out. We needed something that makes lumber. Why don't we go over to the dense tree shack area and see if maybe we can put I, was it the biddy cutter? Did the biddy cutter actually use um If we put in a biddy cutter, let me see if I can find out where this there it is. Let's go ahead and grab I'm going to border this thing off right to there come on up to there and come on oh my gosh did do i oh oh that's my stock pile i ran the stock pile all the way out oh what a boob i am okay we need to get rid of that do 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 and more likely than not, what I'm going to do is I'll just put a, a stockpile here. I'll put a storage barn over here. And then we'll find out something what we can do for. And then we'll find out what we can do about getting a smitty and maybe a lumber cutter. 
put in over here. And we can probably use the, the bitty one of each. And you know, that might actually match. I, I don't know if it will. I haven't used Biddy in a while. But let's go ahead and grab... I think what we're going to do first is put stockpile in over here. And should it be for logs only? Or should it be a generic stockpile? Because you're going to need a stockpile here. Let's go ahead and rebuild your log one. Uh, right here, uh, stockpiles. I want the log one. Oh, no. I want that one. And we're going to start. Let's start by the shack. Uh, red, green, road. There. Because for some reason, I always got to leave a space right there. Boom. My worst nightmare is that I cut off a starting point of a stockpile and they never use it. Now, I'm going to put in another stockpile right here, but it's going to be of the generic type. And the first thing I need to do is grab Angry Flattener, because I don't think there's any resources right there. And I'm going to make a two by whatever I can get in right here. So there's that. Let's come two by five. Yeah, we'll do that. A two by five stockpile right there. Boom. And then let's go ahead and grab stockpiles. And this one's going to be a generic one. Boom. And then across, I think I'm going to go ahead and put in the um, a storage barn. Even though I know... Essay de Ombre has been yelling at me to, to put some markets in. Let's see. Um, doggone it. What am I looking for? I'm looking for my removal for this. Because now that takes the place of it. And while we're looking for that, we can... Or, we'll look at the markets real fast just to see what we got. And I think think this is the market window and maybe come down to a nice area where we can actually see what we got and let's let's go ahead and make our thing a little bit more close up okay so here we got market market ooh that's large and that's almost too much market for what we want what is the radius on this it is fairly large Um, I mean, technically, we could, we could go right here with it. Now, is it, can we flip? Boom. No, it's, it's square, perfectly square. Okay, so there's one option for a market. Does it tell us what it holds? No. Okay, what are you? Small market. We're probably not going to deal with the small market. Number one, the building looks too modern. So what is this? A tiny, tiny market. Central's even bigger, I think. And I really don't... You know what really throws me off here? Is that one large building that's in there. So this must be the rural market. What are you? Cape Town? No, I don't think Cape Town's the answer either. You? No, no, you're way too modern. A Moroccan? No, thank you. An Old Town Market. I've used this before. Flip, flip, flip. Um, wow, that almost looks like it has a larger radius. You know what, Doug Gunnett? We may go with this one. Just to go with it. And if for nothing else, we'll use it for storage. Now, the only thing that would make it more perfect is if it lined up with that road right there. Or the one right above it. 
Oh, no. No, no, no. Don't panic. Don't panic. Yes. Breathe in. Breathe out. That lines up with that road. Holy nuts on a biscuit. Well, that's telling me it was probably meant to go there. So SA, here's your market, man. Boom. You got it. Let's go ahead and frame that in because we're all about framing and making things look pretty. Come around the corner and right to thar. Nope. Right to thar. And now let's find where we're going through. Right there and right there. Okay, we got us a market. I didn't even look to see what the ingredients for this thing was. We need lumber here too. Okay, so that has absolutely confirmed our need for the um, for the things over here. Maybe we'll build up on this thing and um, let's see what we can do. So let's go ahead and um, think, think, think. Gosh darn it, I hate it when my mind just stops. Let's come into here and we needed lumber. Foresters, no. Is this our lumber producer? No. Where's our, Yeah, I think this is our lumber producer. Now the bitty, it does make, and the chop chop, the chop chop might be more appropriate for this. So it's a little thing like this that we can actually stick right on the corner. That is a very, very stupid layout. It is. It's I mean, I'm I'm calling I'm calling it as it is. Now, okay, you know one thing that we can do with that though? Let's do the flip flip flip. Here we go. Flip flip flip. And actually, if we we can put it on the road there, and that's not gonna impede much onto anything and that still gives us a little bit of build space back here for something because there's nothing else we're going to put right there so you know what by golly it's going right here so cha-ching just like that that's going to get us the lumber we need now we need more tool stuff over here so let's go to a do we want the bitty one? Or we can do the single chopper dude. Because the single chopper dude makes tools also. And just to make it look nice, I'm thinking about taking this across. Matter of fact, doggone it. Or do we want to come down here? Because you know what we need are the reeds. And I'm thinking it looks like we might be able to get a couple more reeds in right here than we will over here. And I know I was against putting reeds on the creek. But I'm thinking desperate times are calling for desperate measures. And that might have to be what we do here. Let's just, let's see, because I think we can get two reeds in right here. Let's go ahead and look at that. Here, here, um, go to here, go to here, and flip it, flip, flip. Okay, can't go there, but we can go there. And you know what? I think we're going to do that. So if we went one there, then we went one, two, three. There's a second one. Can we space it? Don't know why I would want to, but no, we can't. Okay, one there. One there. Okay, and then we're going to get some survival coat action going in here, too. You're built. I'm going to throw a builder into you. 
right away to make lumber. Construction limit. I don't know what else that's going to fill up with. But we'll take it off of there. I'm going to go back and check our, our trader real fast. Are you doing anything for us? Okay. If somebody can tell me what's wrong with this trader, please let me know. Or does this trader need to go on the water? I don't know. Anyway, it looks like our trader over here. Are you the one with the corn seeds? Yes, you are. 1,000. Oh, my God. What? I thought I put in 3,000 of the um, tobacco leaf. Oh, my God. I put 3,000 stone in? The heck was I thinking? No. Stop jumping on me. There, 3,000 tobacco leaf. Now, make it happen. Oh, my God, why do I have stone in there? What a boob I am. Okay, let's, um, doggone it, that is bothering me up there. Okay, Marlene, Saskia, are you there? Because I really need something to happen over there. Otherwise, I am going to freak out. Let's come across the river again. See how things are going. And now we're going to deal with iron. And I'm almost wondering if we can just come draw a road straight down to an iron shack. Or are we going to have to come down to this? In which case we should still... Nomads, baby! Nomads, baby! Yep, we'll take them. Where are you? Where are you? Are you here? Nope. Are you here? Yep. Ten of them. Whew. Okay. Ten allow. Let's start with the allow. Boom. They're in. Let's get a house for them. And I'm thinking boarding. We need to get some type of a boarding house put in. And I'm almost thinking right up here. Kind of get them out of the city, but. Or do we want to put them like against the wall over here? Let's first see how big this boarding house is. So go to houses, go to boarding houses. And I think, whoops, no, you're the, you're the first one. And that is almost too nice for what we're doing. But you know what? By golly, maybe that's what we need to do. So let's do flip, flip, flip on this thing. Will you go in right here? Oh, man, you sure will. Or is that too far out? Maybe. No, I, I, I want to put my um, regular people in over there. Um see how this looks nope that doesn't fit nicely there let's go to ah oh, nuts on a biscuit where would you put a boarding I think we're going to go back into the industrial area and I think we're going to go I think we're going on to the back side over here Right to there. Let's make that happen. So cha-ching. Or, 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 or. We never put, oh, we did put the mark. Why don't we maybe put, uh, that would be a big waste of space, wouldn't it, to get a market over here? No, I'm going to let them put the boarding house in back here. And we'll give them something. But that'll give them how many? Ten? Yeah, once they build the boarding house, they're good to go. Okay, let's let's go back to this iron shack thing. 
Uh, tin roof rusted. Here we go. Maybe bring. I think I'm going to bring the road down from here. Now, nah, doggone it. It's not going to fit nicely. I'm going to have to pull it back a little bit. But we'll pull it back as far as we can go with it. Let's do that. So here, here, are you iron? You or iron ore? May as well go straight for the um, for the good stuff. Cha Ching. Okay, come up here. Where's our door on this thing? Um, is that the door? Sure looks like it. Let's see. Uh, flip. No. 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 Yes. Okay. And where did we always had the door open to the to over in here. So that'll work. And I think what we need to do is actually come right into here. Now, which way are you going to jump? That almost looks perfectly placed. I'm going to snap it in and see which direction it jumps to. I don't think it jumped at all. Good. We'll deal with that. Awesome. Let them build this. Put this up here. And I think I'm going to put uh, the tiny shack over here again. And where's my tiny shack? Tiny shack. Nope. Yep. And yep. And, and uh, actually pull it back one. And then come over, come over, come over, come over, right to there. Boom. Okay, that's good. And I think this road here I'm going to take all the way up until we hit this, like that. Take this. Do we want to go straight up into the other road? I think so. Why don't we do that? Let's come straight up into this road. Now let's go ahead and frame this. And so we're going to come this direction until we get to the beaver dam area. And take this one all the way back to the mountain. Like that. And then we'll do the same for the bottom. And you know what? I am going to drag this road down to there and then take this road back to there. And wait, pause, pause. I need to, I, I'm, I can't pause. Shoot. Doggone it. it. It's so funny because I think you did it on purpose. You said you wanted to get me fired up, and by golly, Miss Molly, you did. What am I looking for? I want to see if I can span this with a beaver dam. I don't think so. That looks a little bit wide, but we're going to try. Beaver dam, baby. Beaver dam, baby. Okay, right there. Let's see how far we can go with this. You know, we could, we could cheat and do the flatten tool. But that just doesn't, it doesn't seem kosher to do that. Oh man, do we want to do the flatten tool thing? We can try. We can try it. So I'm going to come over from the main road coming down. I need to go two over. So let's try that. Angry flattener. Um, angry flattener from the main road. One, two. I think that was it. Remove that. And then we need to cross the river to the other side.
Oh my gosh, it's just dropping right there. I don't know if I'm going to be able to follow this line, but it was right here in this. Was it there? Let's try that and see what happens. I mean, if nothing else, we're going to mess it up really nicely. And, and then we're going to try not to look at it because it's going to be a terrible eyesore. Ah, crumbs on a biscuit. Beaver dam, beaver dam, baby. Beaver dam, baby. Oh my gosh. Score. Drop it before it changes its mind. And now let's go ahead and get the uh, roads going up to that, right to there. And then I don't know how far that's going to go in, but... Awesome. And I'm not going to put anybody in down there yet because we're getting a little bit far out of the out of our reach. But we can draw a road out here, put one more beaver dam in here, take this road across, put another beaver dam in right here. So let's go ahead. Oh my gosh, everything's turning green. Are they getting this thing built? What are we missing? Nothing. We just need builders. Okay, how about one, two, three, eight builders? Come on, guys, put this thing together. The sooner you put it together, the sooner you get a house. See if that gives them any. Oh, and we're going to buy them corn seeds. Let's go ahead and get that over with. Oh, we can't do it. Oh, yeah, we can. We got 4,000 worth of stuff here. So we want one corn seed thing. So here's one. Cha ching And we're going to give you all 3,000 of those. Three, one, two, three. And I'm going to give you 500 of the apples. So 500. We're going to go cha-ching. And we're going to buy those. And now when we put in our mission district, we're actually going to be able to plant corn seeds. And now that I stop and think about it, doggone it, we could have put in the... Um, We could have put in the um, three sisters over there. I'm thinking I should have put that right over here. But you know what? I'm not going to worry about it. Oh, I like the way the lumber's going in right here, though. That's kind of cool. Let's see. What do, do we give them a dock right here? Or do we give them a road? Let's see. Let's see if a road will go in right there. I don't even see the. Um, there it is, right there. So there's the steps. There's the road. So I'm thinking maybe put that in right there. Okay, so we'll do one, two. It's going to be six count, right to there. Five. No, we want six. Am I on the right road? No. Nope. Something didn't add up there. Okay, well, anyway. Five? No, six. Is that? There are six. For some reason, these are three wide, so six should be the magic number. Um, I don't think we're going to go shanties. And if nothing else, I'm almost thinking maybe do a little village right up here. Let's see how many of them teepees we can stick in there. Because we are going to need people over here on this side. And SA, um, I will even consider putting a market in over here for them. Blip, blip, blip. So what can we do? Let's go right off the corner. So we're going to go one, two, three, four. And that's it. We can only get two in. So I think the first thing I'm going to do is frame this so I know how much room we have to deal with. Just like that. I probably am not going to frame that yet. Did we ever put Iron Shack in? Yes, we did. Let's get two people running in that. Um, boarding. Oh, our boarding house is built. Score. 
let's go oh, let's upgrade this and let's go ahead and throw in two people one two do we have two people in here yes we do awesome awesome blossom okay do 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 reads you know what i'm going to i'm going to get the read action going already and oh my gosh i promised doug duck blinds so let's put duck blinds i think saskia said put the duck blinds on the lake i think so But for, I mean, something is telling me freak it. And I mean, I'm looking at this little alcove right here. Run this road up, creek this, and then there's that one, I think it's an urban butcher that uses duck meat right here. And put another tailor over here for the survival coats. Because we got the reeds coming in. Yeah, sorry, Saskia. I'm gonna I'm gonna use this little alcove right there for the um, for the duck blinds. Let's see, I, I don't want to run you all the way up because I'm probably gonna bridge across right there. As a matter of fact, we'll put that in right now, so we don't screw that one up. And I'm going to let them build that also. There we go. Okay. Duck blind's going to go in right there. And ducky, where are you? You're under hunter. You're under here. Hunting blind, baby. And then this is also going to keep Doug happy. Because he's going to get his hunting blind. So let's go flip, flip, flip right there. And you know what? I'm going to flip the whole perspective, so don't fall out of your seat. Tip, 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 tip. Because I kind of want to center this whole thing into this little alcove. See how it kind of dips? I think right there is the center-ish. So right there, you see that's going to go up a little. Up a little. Or, or do we get greedy? One there. One, two, three. I can put another one in there. Oh my gosh, we can actually put three of them in right here. But you know what? I don't want to do that because I want to keep it looking a little nice. Ah, uh, no. How many do we want? <laughs> I mean, this whole perspective is throwing me off. I'm almost thinking put one right here and then go one, two, three right there. And you know what? By golly, Miss Molly, I'm going to do that. So one there, one, two, three right there. Boom. And then that'll be a little hunting camp right here. Okay, let's go ahead and flip back over again. And we were going to put in a first thing they're going to need is storage. And I'm, tr I'm thinking right now, do we want to keep it cute or do we want to go practical? Practical tells us to use a large storage facility right there. I think we will do that. Let's go back to that Celtic type storage thing. Oh, man, I don't know. Um, this thing. And let's see, are you the bright green? Yeah, you are. Flip and gonna stick you right there. Sure, right there. Um, and then that's gonna be storage for the 
the stuff. You know what? Doggone it. No, can't hit pause. Shoot. Um, take that out. I'm going to do a market right here. And the market is going to act as a storage also. Because I'm thinking up here is where I want to put the, the production stuff. And I know it doesn't make absolutely any sense to do that. Because these guys should have a market. And you know what? Just for decoratory issue things, we may put in a little mini market right down here. As a matter of fact, I'm going to flip again. Flip, 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 flip. I think that would be so cute to have a little mini mark, a little mini storage right here. And maybe even put a little mini storage right over there. Because I'm not putting anything else on the water here. I'm going to get these guys in already. So one, two. So there's going to be some duck meat and feathers coming in. Let's grab the angry flattener. And here we're going to do one, two. Oops, only two. Two by two. So cha-ching right there. Over here, and I do have a space between there, don't I? Yeah, I do. Okay. Come over and go right to, is that a space between? I hope so. Right here. Well, if not, we're going to mess it up really good. So one, two, and two. Flatten that out. And now get rid of them. So get rid of you. Get rid of you. And... I'm going to go to the mini storage because, gosh darn it, I love the mini storage. Oh, and it was the the mini is the biggest right here. Boom. And now we're going to do the flippy thing. So flip, flip, flip. And that's going to go right there. So cha-ching. And I'm going to stick another one right there. Cha-ching. And now the duck blinds have their own personal mini storages. Now I'm going to flip again. Flip, 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 flip. And we were going to do, so far to the best of our knowledge, the Urban Butcher is the only one that uses duck meat. Let's get our market put in. How are we going to do the market? Do, 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 do. Let's see. God, it would be perfect It would if it would fit right in here. And you know what? We might just grab a market that does fit in there. That's my OCD talking, by the way. Gosh darn it. Okay, here we go. Markets. Markets. And first thing I'm going to do is grab that old time one again, which was this one. And no, you are one shy. And that's one too many. Okay, so unfortunately, unless we, no, not even that. No, this ain't gonna work. Flip. Okay, this is not our market. Let's go to the rural one. Well, by golly, Miss Molly, I think we found our market. <laughs> Okay, it's not going to grab anything on the left. Oh, I don't want that one. That's the ugly one. Where's my rural? Did they take out the rural market? They did, didn't they? They took out my rural market. Mini. What do you look like? Well, that almost looks like the rural, but it's smaller. Central Market. That is what the one with the building had in it. Oh, you know what? I guess we're going to go with this one. I really don't like that large building. 
but let me see if I could put the building into the industrial area. Like right there. And leave the smaller ones out towards the river. I think we're going to do that. So let's go ahead and drop you right here. Just to drop it there. Boom. And then once they build that, that'll actually act as a storage barn also for this area. And now that we have that put in, maybe put in a little group of, of houses right over here. Now comes the question, do we want to start going a little more modern? More nomads. We don't need them. How's our this thing? We don't have anybody in the boarding house. So you know what? We're going to allow them. I see you. Are you on our statue? Yes, you are. 11. Anything here? No. Let's let them in. Yep. Open borders. That would make Saskia happy. And, okay. <coughs> Our stable here is built. Oh, we need a water tower. And then that's going to get us into perfumery also. So let's do that. Let's get somebody in here, even though we can't use them yet. But let's put a water tower maybe back here. I'm going to put two more teepees right here to, sh to mirror this. And that's going to start housing people. So where are the TPs? Don't lie to me because I'll find you. Here we go. Flip, flip. And I'm going to put one in right here. And then we're going to come over to here. Put another one in. Let's go ahead and frame those. Is that it? Nope. Oh, no. Too far. There we go. And come across. Boom. Awesome. Oh, you know what? And in between. Boom. Okay, perfect. Well, that's not going to fix our housing problem. But you know what we can do here, too? Let's grab four more. And um, there, let's go to teepees. Let's go here. And what we're going to do here is we're just going to do the flippy thing. And I'm going to put four more right here. And then that way we can start building out towards the, um, the water and the bridge. Don't know if I want to put that there. Because then you got to go around his house. I do know that I want that one there. I don't know if we're going to put one here or not. Because we got to figure out where we're going to bring this road to. Okay. And now what are we going to do here? We need to do something here. I'm almost thinking maybe the seafood scavenger can go. Food is still going up. Tools. We need more smitties. And now that we're getting now that we're getting iron into our picture, are we? Is that iron? I guess so. You know what? We need to get more people over in this area. What's gonna attract people? Maybe another market right here. Let's start with a market and then we'll go ahead and maybe put some housing over here and find maybe get some agriculture or something over here. No, maybe not. Maybe clear this area just so we can see what we're dealing with. Over. You don't have a stockpile. That's a problem. I don't know what the halibut I was thinking. Let's get you a market right there so at least you can throw your your iron into a market. Do, 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 do. Can we put old time right here? Oh, flip. Oh, come on, baby. Fit. Fit. Oh, it doesn't fit nice. And that's going to drive me nuts. Oh, 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 oh. It doesn't fit. Do you fit? No, you're even bigger. Well, let's go for a smaller market then, maybe. Wasn't this one smaller? Sure was. Well, by golly, Miss Molly, that might just be our market right there. Okay, 
Let's see which direction everything faces here. Where's your ugly buildings? Oops. You got a big stone building there. I think I'm going to put the stone building to the back. Right there. So we'll put you in right there. So cha-ching. And then that should attract some people. And maybe get some housing action going here. Now, what type of houses do we want to start using? I think we're done with teepees over here. And maybe we're going to start going into, should we do shacks? I know that's going to upset some, <laughs> some of our viewers. But let's see how shacks would fit in. Because the next stage is probably going to be the mission stage. And I don't know if we're ready for that yet. And I got to figure out what direction I'm going to run this stockpile here. Uh, we could do this. Stockpile this way up until there. And then that'll be for iron only. So here we go. Iron stockpile. Are you iron? You sure are. Da -dun, da -dun. And go right here and come all the way up to right there. That'll work. And that almost works. I, I kind of like that. I know it's in front of the shack, but let's see if we can do back-to-back -back shacking over here. That didn't sound right, did it? But <laughs> I'm going to shack up with everybody. And we can even do a mining. Oh my God, that's what we're gonna do. We're gonna we're gonna start getting some statue production going. Heck yeah! So let's. Oh my God, yeah, man, my wheels are turning now. That's a dangerous thing. Without flattening anything, let's see how far into the mountain we can put the quarries. And you know what? Since we're talking, I'm going to go out on a limb and say that we're probably going to be better off finding jade where we're at than marble. Even though marble brings in more, I'm still going to go with the jade just because I think it is more appropriate for the area that we're dealing with. I just got to figure out which mining thing it's under. Right there, right there the green thing. So cha-ching, it would be awesome. Well, flip. Oh my God, it fits in perfect right there. How far can we go before? Okay, right to there. You know what? I think we're going to do that. I think we're going to quarry it right here. And how perfect would it be if we can actually put one more here? Yes, we can. And one more here. Yes, we can. Sound like Michelle Obama right now? Or was it Michelle Obama that said that? Yes, we can. I think it was. Anyway, awesome. Oh, my God, that fits in nicely. So we're going to go right there. So cha-ching, put you in. I'm going to come down to here, put you in. And then we're going to come one more down and now we've got more jade than we know what to do with. Dang straight. Okay, here we go. Let's go ahead. And I know you guys have this frontage road right here. So we'll put that in. Oh my God. And we'll put a couple of those statue carvers in right here and we are going to mass produce jade statues let's see where your ring of influence goes your ring of influence goes all the way to there so i'm gonna have to put some housing in here and it's only appropriate to do the shacks because it's kind of a mining district. I wonder if we can do like a little square thing here and like make it a community. Let's see if we can do that. That Because that would be kind of fun if we can build a community right there. 
let's grab, you know, let's put in our statue carvers first. And they'll be across from the market. That's going to be like a marketplace for them. So, statue carvers. Oh my gosh, I got to go dig for them now. Are you under here? You are right there. Do, do, do. Okay, how many can we put in here? There's one there. And then one, two, three, four. You know what? I'm going to flip them because I don't want them to be um, to be butting up to each other. So there's that. Is that three? One, two, three, four. Nope, we're actually going to have to come down like this. Ah, oh, crumbs. Or we give them a double entryway into the village. Let's do that. Let's do the double entry like this. Like that. So one gun, one's going to go there. So cha-ching. Flip it. One, two. Come on up. Like this. Put you in. And is it, did we just give them a triple entry or a double? One, two, double entry. Okay. And just so we can see what we're dealing with, we're going to do that. We're going to do that. And we're going to do that. Okay. Let them build that. In here, let's see what kind of little square thing we can do for some shacking out here. Nomads, baby. Hmm. Even though Saskia is not in my chat right now, I know she's going to want to say yes to this. Five, welcome to the jungle, baby. Welcome to the jungle. Slash, give me a call, dude. Um, here we go. Dun, 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 dun. All right, let's get let's get some shacking going in here, and we'll build into the center and have like a little walkway, like a little community type thing going. Who died? Trampled by a wild boar. Oh my gosh, we got a um, Game of Thrones thing going on here, where the Baratheon just got trampled by a wild boar. For those of you that. Follow Game of Thrones. Shacking, baby. And we're going to upgrade all of these shacks as soon as possible. So, yeah, that'll work. Check it out, man. And it'll be a double walkway going in through here. Now, the only question is, are they going to fit nicely? One, two, three. One, two, three. And the answer is no. So do we want to go with something a little bit larger that's going to give us... Hmm. Or one, two, three, one, two, three. And I don't want to put, because I'm looking at this, we're going to need, I could put stockpile there and a stockpile here. Here, stock, there, stock, everywhere, stock, stock. Or we do. Stockpiles. Maybe make this the housing community. No, that's going to get inside of our shack over here. So we cannot build there. What if we did this? One, two, three. One, two, three. There's our direction right there. I thought it was one, two, three. Well, that's going to be interesting. One, two, three. You know what? Maybe. Ugh. And then flip, flip. Oh, that's even more. That'll be a triple space coming down there. Now let's look for let's look for another house that we can do right, another style of house. No log cabin wouldn't be right. A rustic abode, salt box town abode. What's a rustic look like? 
doggone it, it might be bigger than what we want. It is three wide, so we can technically put it right there. No, that won't work. There. I think one there, one there, and then flip, flip, one there, and one there. I think that's going to be our winning ticket for this area. So let's do that. And I don't think there's different facets. If I'm not mistaken, the only thing that happens is the door switches sides. There, 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 there. Yeah, so I'm not concerned about that. Um, as a matter of fact, that looks good. Let's start with that. So one there, one, two, three, four, five, one there, and then we're going to go flip, flip, and then we're going to come back, and we're going to go one there, and then we're going to come down and put one right there. Now we need some stockpiles for this, and I think right here we're going to put in another 4x4. Four four. Uh, you know what? I think we're going to make this one strictly for the ore, and we're going to put a 4x4 four four in here that's going to be strictly for the ore. So let's do that. Let's do that. Are you my minerals, such as iron ore, copper, tin ore? Yeah, we're not dealing with that. We're not dealing with that. We're not dealing with that. I think it doesn't Jade go under minerals. I think it does. Let's uh, let's try it. So right here. I don't know. what. Oh, right here. We're going to do a four by four. Oh, my gosh. Why can't I put something right there? Is that a road? Why and why the why the heck would I want to put a road right there? Okay. Anyway, but we can already get one right here. So let's go to there. Let's go to stockpiles, baby. Minerals, boom. And right here, four by four. Nope, wrong way. Right there, boom. And then right here, as soon as I take that road out, which I just did, this has actually got to be a three. This has got to be different, I think. A three by four. Because we got that one extra piece of roadage in right now. You know what? We can fix that real fast, too. Here we go. Where's my remove road thing? If we take this road out, we're going to gain a little bit more stockpile. I want to take eight pieces out, just like that. Hopefully they get on that. What am I missing? Tools. Okay, so we're going to need another, another smitty or two. How on God's green earth can we not keep up with tools? Are you doing anything here? No, you are just for decoration. Because I don't know what else I can do with you. What are you doing? No, camellia seeds. No. I'm always thinking chamomile, but Coke. No, <laughs> we're, we're not drinking Coke here. Or unless you're bringing the other Coke in, in which um, we're not going to go there. Jade Quarry. I'm not even going to watch that get built. Okay, um, doggone it. Let's address our tool issue, because that, that this is ridiculous. If we have to, how are we doing for stone? Where are the stones going? Come on, people. These stones are going somewhere. Where the heck are the stones going to? We're not doing anything with stone. There's some resources. Yeah, go ahead and clear all that out. That'll give us a little something to um to work with. 
maybe we need a different smitty maybe okay let's let's get a little bit in industrial over here and we also wanted to start getting the survival coats into production so i'm not totally ignoring that feature but i think right now fixing our our tool crisis is probably the number one thing and you know what i'm gonna drop that one trading post in right here i mean i'm almost tempted to drop in my um my dock trader right there but i think what i wanted to do here was build the dock traders out and maybe square this off oh but then i'm getting into my fishing circle Doggone it. Okay. Let's, um, what are you missing? Oh, is that where all of our stone has been going is into the markets? If that's the case, I'm cool with that. I'm cool with that. Yeah. Okay. Let's, um, I'm thinking down here since we got iron and logs, this would probably be a feasible place to get a um, another smitty going. And I think we're starting to lean towards the um, more modernizing. And that's not breaking my heart, so getting another beaver dam right now to go right here right there or right there nope i think right there right there is a ticket so cha-ching put that one in we'll get a road going out to that and you know what maybe we need to start considering um some more clothing also so maybe how about a smitty and a tailor I want the tailor more at the reeds, though. Maybe we'll put a tailor back here. You know what? Weren't we going to put a um, the smitty over there? This makes more sense over here. We just got to figure out which smitty we're going to use. So I'm going to do the flippy thing. Flip, 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 flip. Because I'm probably going to have the smitty pointing towards the market. Kind of like our things over here. And now let's look and see what the different ones are that we have to choose from. So here we go. We got this one, which is already telling me no. This one here, Old Smith for basic tools. And that that is kind of rustic. Oh, but this is basic tools. And that's actually the only facet it has. Okay, let's keep going. A stone, an old smith. This one's also for basic, but more stone use. A humble blacksmith. Vanilla tools. I don't want vanilla tools. I hate vanilla. You know, it's it's real funny. A little, little trivia here. The port thing. I am, I am just as particular with my ice cream as I am with my pizza. Too big and too small. <laughs> Three bears here. Goldilocks, don't even know how to pronounce that. Um, and what I'm trying to say is, ooh, kind of small. I like, I, I don't like vanilla. And as a matter of fact, vanilla is probably my least favorite flavor of ice cream the only other flavor that comes close to vanilla tiny smitty i think that's going to be our ticket would be garlic ice cream and we did try garlic when we went through gilroy and you know what it it wasn't fantastic the smitty, I'm going to put you more to the iron, just in case you catch fire. I don't want you burning down our dense tree shack or our dense tree forest. So I'm going to put you right there. 
And what we will be putting something else in over here. I just can't think of what it is right now. So let's let's leave that the way it is. You know what? Hmm. How about two Smitties? How about two Smitties? And then they're going to have a double road between them. One, two. Yep. There's our answer right there, man. We are no longer going to have this tool. Oh, there it was. Whoop, there it was. We're no longer going to have this tool crisis issue going on. We're just going to... We're just going to nab it. Just like that. And then they can use the market as their storage. Yep. Oh, no. I feel a sneeze coming on. And that's going to bother me because... <laughs> Excuse me. Because I've got that gringo nose thing going on here that sneezing makes me... um. It makes my nose run <laughs> for some reason. It's more information than you guys needed, but now you know. Boom. There we go. We can stick something in between there. How about some more reads? That might be our answer. And you know what? As long as we're connecting things. Ooh, do we want to do that? Because I'm thinking that could easily be more housing. Or it could even be stockpile or something. I'm going to leave that alone for now. Let's go to this smitty here. You know what we're going to need out here is more housing. And if we ever get into coal, we can actually get into the carbon steel tools right here. And that's usually my go-to um, tool. Yeah, um, let's, let's think about where we're going to do coal next. And as long as we're putting shacks in, we may just do the, we may just do the, um, I'm going to try for iron tools. Boom. Hold off. Uh, uh. Okay. Sorry about that. Be proud of me that I didn't hit pause. I think we're going to get some more housing action going down here. And I don't know, maybe this right here for a coal shack, just because it is totally out of the way of everything. And even if we do not get the maximum exposure, or we can go this right here that's going to get us a larger exposure let's look at the size of this thing and see where it would fit Dog, gun it i keep looking at chat thinking something is not working because i can always count on marlene and saskia to drop by and for some reason it's not working right now Dog, gun it that upsets me I don't know what I'm doing. I'm, 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 having, I'm having a brain freeze here. Let's go ahead and start. If nothing else, we'll beautify this area. We may go ahead and, you know, give them some type of a well or something here. Actually, I don't think we could. Otherwise, we're going to cut off their, their path of travel. But that's that. Okay, let's, let's move a little bit more over. No, nope, I don't want to do that. We were going to check the uh, ring of influences here. There's that. There's that coal, iron, 
Oh, <laughs> excuse me. This does not break my heart to actually lose a little bit of our production into the mountain and into the road, or we would go right here for maximum production. Well, you know what? Maximum production does look a little bit better. And in this case, maybe we would have to open the door to the north. <laughs> King of the North! I think that's what we're going to do. So let's take this road as our, as our boundary and come across, go to the river, and then bring it back one so we can bridge across. And I'm going to go ahead, and I don't know why, already build the bridge, because that's just the way I fly. So where's my bridge? Uh, here you are, and we've been using this one. Um, you know, it doesn't hurt to have a bridge there, even if nobody uses it. But now we have our, our northern point here. So let's go ahead and grab the shack. And I'm going to flip again for some reason. <laughs> I'm just going to flip like this, and then we're going to build the shack up to this road here. So let's come down into here. Let's come down into here. Let's grab the ugly pole. Find out where our door is. Okay, it's not there. Flip. There it is. One, two. There it is. Whoop. There it is. Man, you'd almost think that I'm a rapper. Okay, where do we want to come down? I'm almost thinking, I'm almost thinking go into this corner like right bar because that gives us a little bit on the river to work with and I can't imagine we're going to do much here I mean if anything maybe a little agriculture huh? right there is that it okay let's try to see that and see if it jumps It jumped up one, and I can't tell if it jumped one to the left. But you know what? I think I might want to come a little more over into here because there's nothing else we can really do there. So why don't we come one down and come one to the right? So let's Grab that again. And we're going to come one down. And we're, we're going to go one to the right, like that. Nope, one down. Right there. See what that does. Okay, I'm going to live with that if I can draw a road straight down here. And let's see if we can. Yes. Or to right here. I think I'm going to try coming one more over. I, I know this is totally being anal, but take you out again. And let's see if we can get, let's see if third time is the charm. Pull shack, come down, and I'm actually going to go over like right to there. Come down one and see what that does. I think that there's our ticket right there. That's what we're going to live with. All right, we got us a coal shack, baby. Uh, you know what? We don't even need to keep that up. And where should we put our our shack here? I'm almost thinking maybe shack is going to go on this side. I don't know. You know what? Let's put it more over here because this is going to be more life 
going on over there. So we'll put it over there. So let's grab a shack over here already. Don't know if we're going to put somebody into it yet. But, oops, one, two, there. Boom, put that in. And we can put some roadage going in here already also. So right to there, come on up to there, boom. And then there to, I think we're going to come all the way out to the outside. Is that it? Yeah, I think so. Come up to here, put that in, and then come down to, uh, you know what, I'm not even going to come down yet because we're not ready to deal with that area. But what we are going to do is we're going to put in a coal stockpile. Furnace fuel, raw stuff like clay, that's construction. Coal, right there. And we're, oh man, I feel sorry for this dude who's living here that's going to have coal right in his front yard. But it is what it is. And one more little piece of road in front of the shack right there and we may we may go ahead and call that up to there too you know what why not let's do it and i probably will have to go back to the other stockpiles and put in more more of these but that's okay that's okay. All right. Awesome. Well, that's going to give us maximum coal. And um, we still have a lot of room over here to do stuff. How's our food doing? 24? That actually came down a little bit, didn't it? Okay. Coal shack. Are we ready for coal yet? You know what? Why not? Oh, did I have a limit? People are dying. Crushed by a rock. Oh, my God. How many students? I got nine students. What are we doing here? Um, yeah, why is that limited? Yeah, let's go. Nine, 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 nine. And you know one thing I want to probably do? I was thinking my lumber might be overfilling everything. So I'm actually going to shut this guy down for now. Just because, just because, and um, I'm going to pull him out of there. Because I think right now we got more lumber than we know what to do with. 2,000? Yeah, we do. And I'm going to go ahead and fix our trading posts because you know what? By golly, for some reason, I just don't like the way they stack up over here. And I'm going to go with something a little bit larger. That kind of fits our flavor a little bit better. And since we're not using traders right now, I'll keep the middle keep the middle one in. No. I think I'm going to keep, I'm thinking about keeping the middle one and moving this one over one. And then that way we can put, we could always do a bridge here and do a bridge here. But let's, let's, let's leave them for now because they're not harming anything. This would be a nice flavor for a larger trading post. And by golly, do I want to go with with my old trusted ones? I mean, call me bad. I love this trading post. I mean, this one just screams grumpy. And you guys know I'm going to do it. It's just I got to hit that button. 
Whoop, there's two hours. I'm hesitant about going another hour only because I I don't know if my chat is working and that's driving me nuts because I really enjoy the interaction that we get. I'm going to put this one here. No, I will, I will do everybody the pleasure of looking at what all is available first. And then I'm probably going to go back to the one I want. Trading post, that's the big one. Nope, this one here. A general trader that has, I'll bet you you've got Rustic. No, you don't. You got that and you have that. That and that. That doesn't tell us anything. And you sure, you're a big footprint too. I do see an animal pen. And it looks like a storage barn. But for some reason, you don't want to go right there. Okay, so let's move on. What are you? You're a pie trader. Okay, a vanilla trade items. I have no idea what the heck that means. General trader will not bring livestock. Old town trading post. I've seen other people use this one. I've never used this one, so I don't know. I should probably minimize that. Okay, you don't like to go there either. For some reason. How far did we get? Okay, a general trader? No, I don't want anything with general. Don't want to go farm. Don't want to go tiny. I don't want anything specific to any one item. Wow. Is that, am I seeing correctly? 320,000 capacity. Holy nuts on a biscuit. That almost has to go on a jetty. Wow. Wow. Or right there. But it's way too modern for our use. This is another trading post. Um, what do you look like? Oh, you're vanilla. You are industry. Don't want industry. Biddies. What's the biddy got? That's got that. that. That's just a smaller. Oh, no, you go out. No, I, I'm, I'm not, that's not screaming to, you know what? I've given you guys all the chance to impress me. I've used the mini before in my mini docs. A Japanese one and a Thompson trader. Thompson sounds a little bit too modern for our area. Yeah, so we're going to, we're going to ixnay Thompson. I'm going to do, I'm going to go back to basics. I love this this whole menu right here. And we're going to take this trader and we're going to go right here with it. And we're just gotta, I'm going to center it nicely so that I got a little bit of water on that side and a little bit of water on that side. And I think that's probably it right there. There? No. Nope. Yeah. Or right there. No, right there. That's it. Do, 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 do. There. Okay, stop looking at it. Okay. And once this goes in, I think I'm going to ixnay these up here. And maybe use that district for something else. Does this needle person here... Or did we do two smitties? We sure did, didn't we? Oh my gosh. And we're still not keeping up. Are you needlework? You're a furrier. Well, I'm glad to see that you're making fur. Are you? What What are you doing? Warm coats. You made warm coats for us? Awesome. Thank you. We don't have a... Yes, we do. Right there. So if we're doing warm coats, we must be getting... Oh, my 
God, we got a thousand of them. Those are worth 20 um, units each for trade. On that note, what is our jade mines? Jade is ready for operation. Here we go. One, two, three. And now statue carvers doing jade. Statue carvers doing jade. One, two. Oh, don't have labor force. Yeah, we do. What's your problem? Boom. Did I screw this up? Boom. Where are you guys going? One. Two. I think we're just going to put one carver in each. There we go. That's good. Okay. Perfect. Here's another tool dude. I think we're going to go ahead and get him started. Just because, by golly, Miss Molly, we're... Oh, we did fix our tool crisis. Awesome. Oh, my God. We are styling. How you doing? You are maxed out on something? That can't be right. One less than a million. And did we upgrade you? No. Upgrade. Now, let's start building down towards this person here, because he's probably going to get kind of lonely. And maybe get another, oh, another, another fire tent dude. There we go. And we need, we need to bring housing down here. What's our housing count look like? Okay, we're 10, 12 down for housing. So that might be something to address. Oh, do we need marketeers? Okay, let's get one person. Is one the most we can have? Well, one's all I want, really, in there. And let's get another beaver person here. And let's get somebody into... Oh, there is some somebody in that market. Good, good, good. And you know what? I'm going to drop this down to one. Because otherwise, they have a tendency to all pile into one market. And why did you turn off? I don't get it. Do I have... Th I do have three markets, don't I? Here we go. There we go. So now... Still, how many trader or what, what's a market person called? A vendor. Two, three. There we go. Awesome. Some blossom. What are you missing? Stable. Oh, you just don't have the oats yet. But I'll bet you I have got a metric crap ton of domesticated animals at this time. Do 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 domesticated animals. Let's go by name so we can find them. 15. So I can actually build three of the animal pens. Okay, that's a good start for maybe a new area. Where should we go with animal pens? And I don't have my chatters in there to tell me where to put them. Hmm. Where would you go with animal pen? I'm almost thinking maybe down here. What? Oh, that's just a little flower thing right there. Or we can put animal pens behind here. And we just got to figure out which pens we want to put in. We'll get to that. I'm, I'm not in a hurry to bring that up yet. And what's going on here? Oh, you're a fisherman. <coughs> I thought that was an incomplete bridge going across. Yeah, we're probably going to pull. Oh, and there's a little smoker. I remember you. 
<laughs> Sebastian Bach. Give me a call. I remember you. Okay, so anyway, here we go. Um, where do we go from here? <laughs> There's another song. You know what? I don't think we can use any kind of comment or quote without having a reference to it. Okay, let's... I think right here is the next area we're going to focus on. And we need to figure out what influence we're going to bring into this area. And the first thing I can already see that we need to do is I want to put my my little corner stockpiles in. Oh, there's nothing that can go in there. This one here is going to get a 4 by 4 So let's go ahead and get a generic stockpile. 4 by 4 right there. Uh, I don't want to put anybody in here yet. Because the two people working here should be right here. And no, they're not. They just, they can't figure it out for some reason. Oh, man. You know what? I'm going to leave this open. And I'm going to wait for comments to come in to tell me what to do right here. In the meantime, just so we know what we're, how much room we have to work with or what our real estate is, let's go ahead and frame in those. I don't know if I'm going to if I'm going to do another house right here or not. I got to figure out where this road here is going to butt into. One, two, three, four. Yeah, so even if I put a beehive right here, I'm kind of cutting this off. So we're going to let that, we're just going to let that go for now. And this needs to be squared off right here. So we'll figure out what we're going to do there. But yeah, you guys, let me know what we're going to do here. In the meantime, we'll go ahead and already, somebody suggested this that we clear the resources to the area before we start building. I don't know who said that, but it's not a bad idea because that way they can just start bringing stuff out to that area right away. Oh, and this road is going to be coming down. I just don't know if we're going to put another any other bridges going in. Bridges of Madison County. We're probably going to build one out over here. So let's see. Let's go ahead and uh, get that one in already. So Beaver Dam, baby. Uh, where am I going? Here. Here? Here. And let's see if we can walk this thing over. So flip. Boom. And right to there. So let's try to walk it over. Nope. Do not jump on me. And I'm thinking right there, that might be it. Yep. I think that's it right there. So cha-ching. There's another beaver dam. And let's get this road going to the dam. Just like that. And then we can always put more stockpile in if we need to. But I don't see a need for that yet. We may want to do some, since we're getting a lot of fur right here, we may want to do something over here that's going to, that's fur related. And just to give us a better perspective as to what our, oh my God, it does go over. Perfect. So we're going to square this off right there. And then we're going to take this road down to right there. So I'm almost looking at reeds right here again. 
And so if we're getting reed, and maybe drop in another duck blind for feathers. So that way we've got fur coming in. We've got the reeds and the feathers coming in. So this will be another tailor district. Hey, then it'll be our fashion district. How about that? And I think that might be the way to go. I have no idea how long we ran over the two hour mark, but I think this is a good place to call it the game. Let me see the time. That's 1130. Oh my God, I had no idea there was a mission. Is that okay? GG. <laughs> GG commented about a mission. Yeah, we are going to build the mission. I know I don't. GG, it would be great to have you online while we're running. The mission district is probably going to go up here. And what I'm going to probably start with is the largest mission first, which is this one right here. The mission small. Nope, those are houses. A church for 200 citizens. And this one does not attract nomads, but I want to do the one that attracts the nomads. So this is going to be our centerpiece for the, for the mission district over here. And then we're going to build an entire mission around this. And now that we got the corn seeds going, we'll do the whole corn processing thing. And we may even go as far as getting some agave and tequila going there too. So I'm, I've got a good feeling <laughs> that tonight's going to be a good night, but, um, I've got a good feeling about this build now. I mean, we, we, I can't say we because it was all on me that totally hosed it up last time. But we're, yeah, we reached our southern border here. We're basically on the wall here, up here. Um, we'll figure something over here. I don't know what's north of Lake Kachuma except for farm area. So this might be farming. There is a reservation on the Chumash. I'm sorry. Duh. There's a casino on the Chumash reservation. So I'm almost thinking maybe building up that community. And you know what we still don't have is a tavern. But we'll get to that. Yeah, this is probably going to go in favor of a bridge. There's going to be a few bridges going over to this side. And then we're just going to have to do a new fishing district. And I think what Saskia was saying was maybe start using the lake as a fishing district. And so we'll put all of our fish production buildings in over here. I think that might work. I don't know if we need to frame in this market here or not, but just in case. All right, man. I think it, oh, that would have been too perfect if this lined up. Oh my gosh, it did. Holy nuts on a biscuit. Are we awesome or what? Yes, we are. Yes, we are. Don't even think about that answer. Okay, we're done here. I, I'm going to call this the episode. I think I'm going to try to leave that maybe as our as our thumbnail, just so everybody can see that we got a market. We got two dense tree shacks now, and it looks like they are producing. We have every shack in so far, except for iron ore, which we really don't want to deal with. I mean, if we cheated, we went straight for the iron. But you know what? Oh my God, I, I'm kind of happy with this build. That's a better picture right there. I'm happy with this one. We are growing. I did not hit pause once. So, Essay, you, you need to leave a comment for that one. And last thing I'm going to do is let these nomads in for Saskia. Nothing there. How about the lamppost? 
There they are, 15 of them. Yes. How much vacancy do we have in our boarding house? Or did they all go in there? Do do any blank space? Yeah, we I think we got a couple blanks over here. So what do we got? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Yeah, I think we got seven a room for seven more in here. So that's awesome. Everybody that wants to have wait, we got four homeless people. That can't be good. You know what? We're going to have to get back to them in a little while. Cuz I can't I can't start looking for housing for them right now. And I think that is going to be our no, bring it a little bit more over. No, maybe oh, right there. That looks good. I think there's our screenshot if we get it. If not, it's okay. Hey guys, Word from our sponsor, me, the grumpy one. Hey, if you're watching me on Twitch, please hit that follow button. I would really appreciate that. If you're watching me on YouTube, please hit the subscribe button. Yeah, I know I'm getting views on YouTube. If you have not hit subscribe, please do so. It will really, 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 really keep my grump down to a lower level. And if you do either of those things, or if you have done, please tell 10 of your family, friends, or pets about my channels. If you do not have 10 family, friends, or pets, please tell five of them twice. If you don't have five, go out, buy yourself a hamster, name the hamster Boo, and if you get that reference, leave it below. If you don't get the reference, Lucky you, I'm going to be back in about 10 minutes to start an episode of Baldur's Gate. See y'all later. I am Grumpy Gnome. I'm out of here. I'm going to hit pause now because it's the end of the game. So cha-ching. I'm out of here in 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Take care, everybody. Bye-bye.